Warning, the following video contains material that might not be suited for younger viewers. Parental discretion is advised. But your parents don't even know you are here, so listen. Stay in school, be a nice person, be a helpful person, and you'll go far in life. After you watch this overweight man play a video game and get scared, go do something nice for someone, or yourself. Happy Halloween. Hello and welcome to the Switch Underground, my name is Danny and today we are going to play part four in our Let's Play series of Outlast on the Nintendo Switch. In our last episode, which I just recorded five seconds ago and I'm doing two in a row here, so my heart is still beating, uh, we got chased by the pig guy, uh, we got uh, drugged by an evil priest, and um, we got chased by a homicidal maniac with a club, and he killed us a couple times. Didn't feel great. And uh, it was all around terror. Uh, because I'm a not smart person, um, I'm going to do two in a row here. Uh, I'm not as hardcore as Scrabble, you know. My lights are on. These aren't noise canceling. I can hear people if they come in. And uh, generally don't need that immersion factor with the terror. Uh, we just got a note here. So I want to read it. Here it is. MK Ultra programs. Yeah, ooh, this is the document we picked up didn't read during the when we we're getting chased by the pig dude. On Wednesday, 10th of February 1954, hypnotic experimentation and research work was continued in Building 13 of the Mount Massive Preserve in Colorado using the following subjects: material abridged, okay, uh, post hypnotic of the night before, point, pointed finger you will sleep was enacted. Mrs. Jackson and Pierce immediately progressed to a deep hypnotic state with no further suggestion. Miss Pierce was then instructed, having previously expressed a fear of firearms in any fashion, that she would use every method at her disposal to awaken Miss Jackson, now in a deep hypnotic sleep. And failing this, she would pick up a nearby pistol and fire it at Miss Jackson. She was instructed that her rage would be so great that she would not hesitate to kill Jackson for failing to awaken. Miss Pierce carried out these suggestions to the letter, including firing the unloaded pneumatic pistol gun at Jackson and then proceeding to fall into a deep sleep. After proper suggestions were made, both were awakened and expressed complete amnesia for the entire sequence. Miss Pierce was again handed the gun, which she refused in an awakened state to pick up or accept from the operator. She expressed absolute denial that the foregoing sequence had happened. Yikers. The priest, Father Martin, this son of a bitch has a name, brought me here to show me something. Thinks I'm going to be a witness for whatever batshit crazy he's trying to sell me. This Dr. Wernicke is at the center of whatever went wrong here, but he died more than ten years ago. Rest in peace, says the blood on the wall. Any other notes here? So, I have two options in here. Hide on the bed. Or, you know. Oh, shit. Yep. Let's just pretend this isn't terrifying and that this isn't like being in the middle of a horror movie because, spoiler alert, it is. I don't have enough space for another person, bro, so you need to you need to move on, you know what I'm saying? Um So what, that's just a dude banging his head against the wall, right? Okay. So obviously we're gonna have to run from someone here. Okay, well, what are we all doing here? 
Um, okay, dude's just slapping himself. So, we're in B. Oh. Uh, what exactly are you trying to change your mind about? Oh, the voices. Okay. Okay. So... I'm supposed to try all these doors until some ass hat does that. Pop. Oh, great. Hey. What's up? You want out? Here, I'll help you. You grab me by the face, Bo. What? You want a high five? No high five? What are you doing to that door? You can't do that here. This is a, this is a family room. Okay. Speaking of what, dude? Um, yeah. Cats away. Mm-hmm. Is this guy doing what I think he's doing? Oh my, this is some drop the soap. I'm going in. Not, be, not because I'm a fish. I'm a fish here. But I have to establish dominance. Which means I gotta get in here, smack this guy in the face. Hey. You, uh... Yeah. You're under my protection now. You just do what I say. Put your money in the commissary. Who's this? Hey. Maybe Father Martin's man. Maybe. He looks nervous. I would like to kill him. As would I. The preacher asked us not to. It would be impolite. Not here. We hmm. give him a running start. There's an idea. And when we kill him, we kill him slow. God, I have to patience. I want his tongue. And liver. They are yours. So you guys are... Yeah, well, I don't know if you've seen this place. It sucks here. Plus, those two dudes up there, they have discussed eating me, okay? And that does not feel great. Plus, some a-hole's gonna try to jump out of this window. Nope, oh. oh. okay. There's no lights on in that one. All right, everybody, you, hey, you watch the door, I'm gonna let you live, hey, at least this one opens, okay, Willie's brother, hey, bro, they'll tell you it's, Science, but it's not. They were waiting for us in this place. Billy understood. They've always been here. I hate how he looks at the door, man. After every little shimmy, do we really need to do that? See? I told you. What did I tell you? Oh. Knew it. There's a bunch of beds to hide under, which is probably not a good sign. At least I still have all my batteries. Hey. Hey. Your prison name is Bloodstain, and you are now part of the Garlic Bread Gang, okay? 
You, me, Mr. Wanks upstairs, Billy's bro, and uh, the security guy over there. Oh my god, this one actually opens. Crap. Oh wow, you look um terrified. Well, you have the right idea. I'll tell you that. Okay. Great. Now there's more to the egg. Sick, dude. You were the one just drilling a corpse. You double dipping or is is it like my turn or? What about you, arms? That it's got no head. You're disgusting. Um, well, I mean, you boys have a good time. It's gonna shut the door. All right. I mean, that was some disturbing subject matter, but we are in prison. Silky. Wait until I finish, but I say some for you. Oh, now he's ravenous. God always provides a way. Follow the blood. New objective. Follow blood trails to the exit. Sure. I feel clean. We missed a room back there. I hope there wasn't anything we're supposed to pick up. This a random master or so just hanging out under the stairs. That makes sense. Okay. What is happening up there? Down the drain. Saving. Hey, dude. Talking or? Thinking I don't want to go down the drain. Oh good, some documents. 
a break. Let's see. Patient art program. Patient father. Martin Archambod. Helen. Dr. Zeichner gave me your info to contact regarding the cancellation of arts program. My patient, Martin A., has made enormous strides in his therapy on account of his finger painting. Just in the week since canceling the arts program, his schizoaffective assertions of some higher calling have accelerated enormously. Please, just let the man finger paint. The few dollars you're saving on temper paint is more than swallowed by the cost of clozapine. I can't imagine the logic at play here, unless Murkoff wants our patients to become more disengaged from reality. Please advise. Dr. Neil Wolfram. Neil? I have some news for you, bud. The doc is not a great guy. Alright. Pigman. Are you here? Closing doors behind you will slow your pursuers. We are going to do a save. We'll put a new save. Closing doors behind you. Okay, so there's an open door there. think that guy is obviously going to be coming for us they weren't experiments they were rituals a, a conjuring rituals huh well that sounds bad stuck here. Of course, dude's gonna show up. Obviously, the play is to just wait. And we have to hide in there. Because he's probably on the other side of this door, right? He's not here. Okay, so... Dude's down here, though. And we're probably gonna have to juke him somehow. Not sure how, though. He's up there. Can we get in there? So maybe the play is to just run our asses in there. Do what we gotta do. Can we sneak by this guy? Okay. He's just gonna sit there?
Thanks. Oh my god, I trapped myself outside. I'm an idiot. Okay, let's regain our health, please. Damn it. Okay. That was dumb. Let's see how far back our save is here. Oh, not very far. Okay, so there was some documents back here, right? Oh wow, we busted through that. Okay, so we know that we can come back here. Don't think we can let dude out. gonna play this let's think dudes up there dudes gonna come after us we can shut the door behind us probably hit something in there we gotta hit he's obviously got some anger issues um he does I'm staying quiet. Dude, who'd you kill? I don't really think that guy probably did anything wrong. Okay. So now we know dude is here. Can we hide from this guy? He runs. Not really any place to hide. We gotta lure him out and then run back in. Let's bark. No oh my god, he came out. Hey, bud. I'm not, bro. Okay. What the hell do we need to do in here? There's, there's door one. Did he see us? He saw us. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, we got away. Oh shit, there's an enemy. Oh man, they're faster than me. Okay, we gotta be quicker than that. We gotta be quicker than that. Okay. So we run in there. Oh wow. I'm actually here. Cool. What an excellent save point. Although, I'm sure these dudes are out here. Probably another one we gotta hit inside that other building. Hey, bud. See me? Goodbye. <laughs> Okay, let me get some health back, because there's another ass in here. Tell me there's a locker. Well, that opened the airlock, but was that the one we wanted? I don't know. They're not busting in. So just maybe. There's a chance, but we know where we gotta run. Where the hell's the other guy? Just go. He sees us, he sees us. Where's idiot number two?
badass right. We're just that good. We sneak. And here we are, following the blood once again. Is there a dude in here? These freaking doors, man. coming out or y'all got male parts not at very um, attention you know I'm starting to Ledge sucks. I know they're up there. At least I think they are. Should I try to go up. This door needs a key card. Lovely. Where, oh, where could the shower key card be stored? Somewhere in here? Possibly. Ooh, a document. Let's read it. Proper purge gate maintenance is crucial to Project Wall Rider security. Please refer to Murkoff Court Maintenance Manual or seek guidance from a supervisor with a proper security clearance. Supervisor. Alright, let's just scope out the rest of this room for a second. Don't see a ride of battery. Good. Okay. Alright dudes, I think that's gonna do it for this particular episode of Outlast. I'm gonna check out the security monitors here. I don't see anything that I wanna see at all on here. It's all terrible. Just evil, evil shit happening here all the time. Cool screensaver. Uh, if you enjoyed your time here, go ahead and give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if we wanna continue in episode 5. Sorry, thought I heard something. And uh, we're going to have a good time. My stomach kind of in knots right now, right? I've been like shaking. I'm not, I thought maybe I'd be desensitized and maybe I am a little bit by now. But it's mostly just like settling into the fear, right? You're just constantly expecting something awful to happen. And I don't really want to feel like that forever. So it's time to take a break. Um, be good to each other. Take care, and I will see you in the next one.